Hey guys, my name is Iman and in this video I'm going to show you how to work with a software called PhotoJet. By using this software you can sort your images super fast while you are watching them on a full screen mode. If you want to download the software just check out the link below and follow the instructions. It's super easy and fast but in order to save time I already downloaded and unzipped the package on my desktop. So let's start. If you click on it a window pops up and you are prompted to choose a folder so select the images folder that you want to sort I already created a folder on my desktop called test so let's select it and open it uh, if you want to go to the next image just move your mouse to the right if you want to go back to the previous image just move it to the left so it's very easy and fast to go back and forth between images and also you can rotate, uh, for example, I want to rotate this image to right. So all you need to do is to go top right. And I want to rotate this one to left. So all you need to do is to go top left. And if you want to save uh, an image in your favorite folder, just go up. Oh, I love this one. Go up. And if you want to delete an image, just go down. Just in case if you uh, did something by mistake, for example, if you go down, which means remove this image, don't panic. You can undo whatever you just did. For example, you can go, if you want to undo that, just go um, down right, undo. So basically, you can undo whatever you just did. And also, uh, the last thing that I want to mention is uh, you can compress the images. For example, let's say you want to email 10 images to your friend and you want to compress their size. So all you need to do is to go uh, down left and then you need to select the compression level. No means no compression and extreme means extreme compression. So let's select extreme. Oh, that's too much. I don't like it. So let's undo it and then do it one more time. Medium. So as you can see, the original size here is 8.4. And the compress size is uh, 1.2. And also you can do a combination of different things on one image. For example, let's rotate this one, compress it, and save it in the fo favorite folder. And that's it. After you're done, just press escape. And... Uh, as you can see, uh, a folder is created on my desktop called test processed. Because at the beginning, I chose a folder called test. So that's why the software created a folder for me called test process. So for example, if you choose a folder called uh, birthday, you will get a folder called birthday processed. I just want to emphasize one thing. I didn't touch the original images. Uh, so they are still here and they are intact because I know some people get mad if you mess around with the original images so they are still here for example the one that I deleted still here uh, all the changes happened in this folder in the other folder test processed for example the image that I deleted is not here or I have some images in my favorite folder the food the other one and yeah, like the last one, I compressed this one, and then I rotated it to the left, and then I moved it to my favorite folder. So all the original images are intact here in the original folder. But you know what? Uh, if you're happy with this folder, just go ahead and delete the other one to free up some space on your memory. Uh, I guess that, that's it. Uh, thanks for using PhotoJet, and hope you have fun with it.